Today I want to share with you a new website that I found called superteachertools.com. On this site there are several different classroom management tools that you might find interesting. So when I go to the website I click the tools menu and you can see that there's a seating chart maker, a group maker, and a random name generator. Today I'm going to show you the random name generator. If I click on random name, name generator I first need to create a group. So I'll create a group and I'll call the group my sample class. And I check the availability to see if it's there and then I need to create an account. So I'll create an account and click create. They'll send you a confirmation email <coughs> as well as your password and you'll get a link that you do need to bookmark so I'll click on the link it'll take me to the class <clears throat> I'll enter my password to sign into the class and you'll get a sample group and just to demonstrate the random name generator I'll click on random name generator from the sample class that comes with it the names will appear here I just click next and various names will appear from the group list <coughs> So to create my own group, I click on Create or Import. You can upload a, a, an Excel spreadsheet, but if not, create your own. You can either type the names of the students, or you can have the students type their own names when you're done. Any blanks are left blank. Click Create Class List. When I return to the Groups page, here's my test class. If I click on uh, random name generator. Here's my random name generator. Pick the student. I return to the groups page again. I can create sample groups. This is great for dividing students into groups for doing a collaborative project. So I click on that. I'll put two people per group. Notice that there's many different options. Depends on the math for your group. And any odd numbers will be placed to the next available group and I'll click create. So now I have group one with these two students, group two with these two students. And that's a real simple tool from superteachertools.com.